The Amazing Race is back with season 32. And serving as host and co-executive producer is Phil Kogan, and he's joining us live this morning. We are so lucky to see him and to have him with us. Good morning to you. Oh, look at your backdrop yeah. with the fire. Looks so cozy. Let's have a nice fire. Let's have a nice cup of tea, and let's have a nice uh, fire side. I like it. I like it. All right, we'll start with this. Congrats first on the 32nd race. How does it feel to you? Uh, it, it, I'm, first of all, I'm very, I feel very lucky that I'm a part of something that people want to watch. Um, so that's a good thing. Um, but I'm so relieved for the fans because the fans have been so incredibly pa um, patient waiting, not just the fans, but also those who are on the show. Um, this has been a very challenging time for everybody. And I think the timing of being able to escape on a race around the world, it was shot before the outbreak of the pandemic. I think just because everybody has been on lockdown, I've been on lockdown like everybody else, the world has not been waiting for us, if you know what I'm saying. Like that's normally what I say at the beginning of the race. The fact that we can all escape and from the comfort of our homes, um, safety of our homes, I think the timing couldn't be better. And Phil, what can you tell us is different about this race? Well, uh, the things that always, the, the, the two, two key elements that make each season of The Amazing Race different are the people and then where we go. Um, and unlike other shows where they go back to the same place, they go back to the same studio, we never do that. And I think that is what makes the show different. New people going to new places, doing new things, um, places we've never been to before. That is what is different every season. And I think that's part of the longevity the, of the show or the reason that, that the show has continued for so many years is that we don't repeat ourselves. And so you're going to see us going to Trinidad in the very first episode, Trinidad and Tobago. You'll see us going uh, to Colombia, then into the heart of the Amazon, then to Kazakhstan, then into Asia. And um, so the, the, the background is always different. And of course, we always put all people in and we have probably the most competitive. I've said it before, but boy, this season we have got some competitive contestants. We've got um, ex uh, NFL players, um, some track stars who've uh, Olympians who have gone to the Olympics. Um, we also have some professional volleyball players. Uh, and then there's some, some, there's a team of real estate agents. Now you would think, how could real estate agents be competitive? Oh, they're competitive. They're kind of like at, a, at an Olympic level of competitiveness because when you're selling, you're selling up against everybody else. And so I love that dynamic that you could have somebody who's not only competitive in the real world, but also competitive in the sporting world. And now we get to let them settle the score on a, on a show like The Amazing Race as to who's the most competitive. All right, before we go, can you tease ahead to tomorrow's first episode and just give us a little hint? Well, it starts in Los Angeles, as I mentioned. They'll be racing to Trinidad and Tobago. They'll be getting off the plane, going straight into a night show. They'll be celebrating with some steel, uh, with a steel drum band and some, some people who take part in the big carnival that takes place in Trinidad every year. Next to the Brazilian carnival I, in, in Rio, I believe it is the biggest in the world. Um, then they'll be heading to Tobago, which is a little island off the coast of Trinidad. And then from there into South America, into the Amazon, into Europe, uh, to Kazakhstan, deep into Asia, and then from Asia back to the United States. Sounds like a ton of fun. Phil Kogan, always good to see you, and thank you very much. And we wish you nothing but the best. We'll be watching. All right. You guys look after yourselves. It will do. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Phil. And watch the season premiere tomorrow night at 9 right here on CBS2. Since we can't travel, oh, Phil. it's nice to go through the it show. It is. You know? I love the show. Escapism. Mm-hmm.